What's good creators? Welcome to Monzon Media, a home dedicated to the content creator that is just starting out and keeping budget in mind. Now today I'm going to show you how to create an animated YouTube end screen in Canva. Now you can do this in the free version as well as the pro version, but just keep in mind that some of the animation features in the free version is not available, but uh, there are a few that you can utilize for your end screens. Now, before you start laying out your template, keep in mind the size of the end screen rectangle. Now for this particular end screen that I'm doing, the size being used is 625 by 349. So now I'm going to start laying all the components on top of the template. Here's where all the magic happens and really it's done very easily. You will see on the top left corner here that there is an animate feature. Once you click on the animate feature, you'll see that there are a few options you have like block, fade, rise, and tumble. Again, for the free version, some of these are not available. Um, but you can still work with the ones that are available for free. All these animations have an intro animation and an outro animation. Now, if you only have one page showing, add a second page and leave it blank. You will see the intro and the outro animation happen. Now this will give you a 10 second end screen clip, which I think personally is long enough. So now that your animated end screen is complete, you would now just export this video from Canva, import it into your video editor of choice, whether you use DaVinci Resolve, Final Cut, iMovie, doesn't really matter. Import it into your editor and add that clip at the very end of your timeline. And once your video is rendered and uploaded to YouTube, go into YouTube Studio, click on the editor option on the left of the menu, and that will bring up YouTube's video timeline. Just below the timeline, you will see a plus button to add your end screen. Click on video, and then you will have three options to either add your most recent video, one that's best for the viewer or a video that you want to specifically choose. You will see a highlighted marquee of that end screen and all that's left to do is to 
grab that end screen and line it up with your template. Click on save and you're done.